So, how long are you gonna do this? We both live here. We have to deal with each other every day. We might as well be friends, don't you think? No, we don't. I plan on spending my entire sentence already. We both did some illegal shit. We both got caught. Get over it. You stole my life. You stole my good life that I made after you. Stay the fuck away from me. You know what? Fine. I'm in here at five just about every day. If you don't like it, avoid it. You named me. What? You didn't have to take me down with you. <laughs> so that's what this is all about. You think I named you? <laughs> that's great. You haven't seen me in five years. You had no idea what was going on with you. I'm a different person. I was feeling alive. Cool! Hooray! Good for you, Piper. I didn't name you. It wasn't me. Alright? Bullshit. I know it was you. You never forgave me for leaving. Dude, 13 people were indicted. 13. You met all of them. We traveled together. I know it was you. It wasn't me. And you know what? Fuck you for thinking that it was. Fuck you! What is it? Did they give you time off for every innocent person that you threw under the bus? Is innocent. that it? Innocent. Did I just hear that right? Innocent? That's fucking hilarious. No one had a gun to your head. You carried that bag. Your fiance might buy this bullshit, but I know you, okay? I know you, Piper. And there were no complaints when I took you all around the world. But the second shit got real. You put me in danger. You loved it. You were just this boring little girl from Connecticut who wanted to feel loved, special, bad. Don't do it. Don't you fucking do it. Don't turn this around on me. This is all on you. You know what? You're probably right. I might not have never forgiven you for leaving me because you broke my fucking heart, but I've never, ever lied to you. And I've done a lot of shit in my life. And I've never lied to you. So fuck you.